So I once heard about a teenage boy in Italy who was close to death from a severe infection. He'd had a septic shock for days and his only request was to feel the sun on his skin one more time. And within days of being wheeled outside, his body began to turn a corner. And yes, the chances are that the modern medicines that he was being given had a significantly greater impact than just being outside. Of course they did. But what the evidence suggests is that patients who recover in a hospital bed near a window actually get discharged sooner. They recover quicker. Infrared light from the sun penetrates deep into the body and helps to regulate melatonin, which protects against heart disease, against dementia and diabetes. And even in cloudy countries, there are practical ways to harness light, from spending time outdoors daily to using safe light therapies. Now, working in A&E, I see people at the end stages of illness all the time, but it always comes back to the same truth, that the simple things, things like movement, sunlight, water and rest and social connection are what prevent disease in the first place. And sometimes the best medicine isn't in a prescription, it's in the environment around us. 